Welcome back to Crypto Kingdom 78. If you're new to the channel, this channel is all about uh, tokens I own and finding diamonds in the rough early. 10 and 11 zero price tokens, real nice and early. Try to find ones that nobody knows about, you know, ahead of the, the, ahead of the pack. Get in early, buy trillions, and then uh, knock some zeros off. So far, if you're new to the channel, you can go back and look at some of my other videos. I'm hitting about 90, 90 to 95% in the, uh, you know, here's the token, you know, and here's the price. And now look at the price, you know, a week or two later, some of six times to eight, eight times. To, um, in some cases, um, I think I've had one 10x since the first video. Regardless, I haven't had too many go down. The one that I'm not going to mention today is down, and I thought it was going to be the big one, and it was a lot more expensive than like an 1101. I, I know it'll bounce back, but just the point is I'm hitting about 85, 90%. Uh, my channel is not for financial advice. It's simply showing people what I own. If it's a substantial amount, I will show my wallet, no problem. Currently holding 81 to 82 tokens, just give or take on the staking. Yeah, if I stake for a new token, it kind of gives me a new token, so that'll, you know, up my uh, my value of how many tokens I have. Uh, $350,000 US in the minimum, 2.3 to 2.5 million US at the peak, which um, I'm just playing around here. Like I, I didn't really, I didn't really dump too many unless, unless I had trillions or something. I'm not going to, never am I going to put up a token and then probably sell it all like these other people dumping, uh, you know, if you own 3 trillion and you're in the driver's seat, you know, price-wise, why would you get rid of all $3 trillion? You'll feel like a fool if you get rid of $3 trillion and the price doubles again. So I have flipped some to cover my uh, SafeMoon portfolio and stuff like that. So a lot of the tokens that I have on here are pure profit. Like they just started, you know, $300, $200. I think my best one so far this year, outside of Red Panda Earth, you know, that's 5 or 6 x But I've had ones where I had, uh, I can't remember the number of tokens, $250 go to $12,000 within three hours. So that's one of my better ones. I've got bigger numbers than that for, you know, not for speed, but, uh, well, actually I do. Baby Doge I had when it went, um, when it went up like real quick the one day, three grand. Well, it didn't, you know what? It's still only 10 X. It went from like three grand to 32,000 in one day pretty quick. So I am pretty good at finding these tokens early finding tokens and you know not a lot of people know about this only has around 7500 holders give or take so we got a lot of growing room here <clears throat> just showing people red panda earth uh my only negative again with some of these um, tokens like red panda earth the total supply is very large which just means time it's just a waiting game however if you got lucky and got this at 11 zeros and you got trillions at 11 zeros, which you could have, you know, bought trillions for a real good price. I think when it gets down to seven or eight zeros, we don't have to hit a penny on these. That's the whole idea. Everybody wants a penny or a dollar out of some, but you don't need to to make a better return on these. So again, if you're new to the channel, not financial advice. These are simply tokens I own. 95% of these and the 5% really haven't shown that many that I don't own. Um, that's all I'm going to show. If I'm not going to buy it, I'm not going to show it. So uh, Red Panda, PAL, NFTs are, are here. The price has gone up just because they're, they're real active on Twitter. They just did this culture uh, meet or group meet the other day. I was reading all about Twitter here before I made the video. Uh, I like most of their stuff and, um, you know, I share it, I retweet it, whatever you want to call it. Uh, they, they have more here that I missed eight hours ago. So you can see the uh, group meeting is right here that they had. Culture conference, I guess they called it. So they do a lot of things just outside of animals as well, a lot of charity work. You can see on here the uh, Red Panda Earth is 621 of 3,087 coins on Lo uh, Lunar Crush. We jumped 550 spots. So they're making moves. It might take a while, but I already liked and retweeted that. I'm just trying to get more people involved. They made a tweak to the NFTs. So the Red Panda Pals collection Oh, sorry, this one's on, I thought it was on Rarible. I think this one, yeah, this one's on OpenSea. So if anybody's holding NFTs or whatever, open up an OpenSea.io. You'll need it if you want to get into the uh, NFT space. Well, at least for this token and quite a few other ones. There's only about three or four big NFT spots for holding them, buying them, and keeping them. It's like kind of like storage. So the NFT proceeds go to charity and Red Panda Earth growth. So, uh, you know, their slogan, don't forget to mint one today. 
if anybody's tried again, put it in the comments um, section. I haven't tried minting one yet. So they're very active on the Twitter. Here's the Cincinnati Zoo, just uh, showing red pandas. But before I found the token, I this was one of my favorite animals, as I said before at the zoo. Just the rarity of it. You don't look in a you know in a cage and see ten of them. It's just one guy, and it kind of looks like a giant raccoon to me. It doesn't you know maybe the shape of a panda, but a big red raccoon maybe. Uh, they're pretty cute. Can't uh, say they're not. Just a rare animal. Not every zoo is even going to have this animal compared to like a lion and tiger or something, which is more common. Uh, they, again, they do lots of charity work. we got to get more people involved in this. So I'm hoping new people to the channel check out uh, Red Panda Earth Token. I can't say much more about it just because not much has changed other than an NFT update and a price doubling. You're still in good position to um, you know pick up some tokens if you want to. Um, I'm not going to suggest how many to buy. That's totally up to you. Just do the math and, you know, figuring out knocking down zeros. So uh, like and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to keep, uh, I got lots of videos to do. It's uh, hard, you know, in a 24-hour day just to keep on top of all these tokens and changes. But anyways, uh, if you're new to the channel, welcome aboard and uh, we'll see you in the next video.